Denver's mayor, Mike Johnston, says the city is on a path to hit one of his main goals surrounding homelessness, getting 1,000 people off the street by the end of the year. He just wrapped up a news conference touting city-bought hotels as well as micro-communities. This happening just hours after a large-scale homeless sweep in Cap Hill. Denver 7's Veronica Acosta listened into that news conference with the mayor. Veronica, what are some of the big headlines here? Well, you know, the mayor showed this map that was really interesting, and this time around he kept that update fairly short. He showed that map that had different housing sites around the Denver area that could ultimately become housing sites for those who currently are living on the streets, who currently have no home. Some of those sites, like you mentioned, included hotels, others micro communities. Those were just plots of land. He also spoke about the 200 pallet, uh, pallet homes rather that he plans on having the city acquire very soon. And that press conference was happening as some city staff members were cleaning up this encampment behind me. You can take a look and see what's left of this. Now, this looks completely different than it did yesterday when we were here when the encampment cleanup was originally scheduled for. You'll see there are no more tents, no more structures right now, at least in this portion near 18th and Pennsylvania. Those have all been cleared. Take a look at this video, though. This is video that we gathered earlier this morning. Denver police officers walking through that encampment. You could clearly see some of the tents that were up earlier this morning. That was just three or four hours ago. City crew members spent hours not only putting up that fence you see in the video, but also handing out pamphlets to those who were living here, even giving them information on different resources that they can have access to. And let's also show you the area that's closed off this morning. This is a map that we made for you so you can kind of see it's everything in this yellow square. 20th Street to the north, North Washington Street to the east, East 16th Street to the south, and then Grand Street to the west. Air Tracker 7 also flew over this area earlier this morning. In this video, you can see kind of the entirety of the area that was fenced off and is still fenced off this morning. And slowly but surely, we have seen as some of the encampment residents have just chosen to pack up their things and willingly move. Some breaking down the tents, others simply leaving them there. And Jason, as for those who left the tents there and just kind of took off with their more personal belongings, we saw a lot of those tents and structures being thrown into garbage trucks. That's why it is cleaned back there. As for the process of this all, now that it's clear of those tents and structures, a maintenance crew will come in make sure everything is good and those fences that you see those will stay up all right our denver sevens veronica acosta reporting live from denver's cap hill neighborhood veronica thank you